Kathleen Pervancher from Team Pervancher, and I'm here with Sherry Jacobs. Hi, everyone. And we just wanted to say hello and welcome to the team. We are so happy. Sherry was with our team previously, mm -hmm. and she just came back to our team, and we're ecstatic to have you. Yeah, I'm excited to be here, actually. So I was looking at EXP and all the opportunities that it gave to me, and I sat down and figured out last year what I would have made had I been here at Team Provancher, and it was $35,000 difference. That's a lot. That's like three deals, easily. Yeah. Um, and so that adds up over time, and definitely. I've, I've been running the numbers for a lot of agents, and it's so funny because sometimes I talk to some of the agents and I say, how much money have you given your brokerage this year? That's right. That's my question for every agent watching this. I've got two questions. Number one, how much money have you given to your broker last year? Last year was a good year for everyone. 2022 was good to us agents. 2023, I don't think is going to be as good to us. Not as easy. It's not going to be, it's going to be um, skilled based and it's going to be someone that has support. And working your butt off. And working your butt off. Absolutely. So we are going to need at, in 2023 to keep every cent mm -hmm. that we work hard for. Absolutely. Yeah. And, and also in looking, you know, for my future, it wasn't just the $35,000 extra. It's also, you know, someday I want to retire. I don't want to be doing this from the nursing home. So, mm -hmm. you know, I was thinking about the stock program that they offer and also the residual income that you get just from other agents coming on to EXP. And I'll those things all add up. Let me talk about that. Anything that you pay into EXP as far as going towards your cap, mm -hmm. and and um, I'll, I'll say that in a second, that money you get back as stock. Right, correct. And I'm going to cap like that. So yep. it's, it's going to be super fast, super I know. easy, and I'm super excited. I cap like the first week. Literally, yeah. I capped the first week that I was here, and and I couldn't, be I couldn't believe the amount, like, when I would get a check from the other brokerage that I was at, I would look at the check and be like, okay, all my money's Where's gone. Where's the rest of it? All my money's gone. <laughs> I worked my butt off and it's like, and then that money, the realtors, let's talk about this, that tax money isn't taken out. That's correct. That tax money. So it goes either to your broker or it goes to the IRS. Correct. Yeah. This way it's going, you still got to pay the IRS, you guys, but... This way, I mean, you're getting more money in your pocket. Absolutely. Something else we should talk about, too, is the support. I mean, at other brokers, you either have good admin support, you might have good marketing support. And I think at EXP, you know, it doesn't matter who's on vacation or who called out sick today. You always have a group of people that are there to help you. Yes. We have, we have, um, we have you know, live human beings here to help you. Absolutely. To say, you know, this is what you need to do. This is what you need to do. And to kind of help you when when you're a realtor, it's you know you take this test by the way, and they shoot you out in the world, and no, a lot of people don't know what the heck they're doing. You know, they don't teach you really how to be a realtor. They, they teach you how to write a contract and maybe the law, but um, you do so much. You, I mean, you're working constantly from your car, from your home, from your couch, from things from eight to midnight. Almost. And your knowledge base is you know anywhere from you know probate law right to termites. Exactly. I, I mean, things that I, you know, I said to someone the other day, I know, I know about every kind of termite. I know, you know, I know way more about termites than I should, <laughs> you know, so it kind of goes into all these different areas that if you're a really good realtor, that you know these things. And, you know, I'm here. Mm -hmm. And just because I've been around the block in real estate, you know, and there's a lot of us here that it's at our team that it's a wealth of information Absolutely. to draw from. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would agree. Whether it's contracts, whether it's the city of Vero Beach, whether it's, yeah. you know, how to persuade a seller to list or or a buyer to buy, there's always someone to give advice. Yes, and how to do the situation the best. The one thing that I would like to go back to is the um, how much you pay to the broker. Um, I want to ask the, the realtors out there, that's my question to you guys. How much did you pay to your broker last year? Sure. That's number one. And number two, what did you get for that? All great questions. Yeah, right? Absolutely. Because once I ask the realtors those questions, 99.9% .9 of you guys don't know the answer to that. Yes. And once you actually do the math on it, 
It's pretty amazing. It is. It is amazing. It's frightening, actually. Yes. <laughs> yes. And a lot of a lot of the agents that work a lot, I've been talking to them, and the number one thing that they say is, I don't know how to leave because they're so busy. Sure. And we helped you with that, right? Absolutely. We were able to figure it all out and move forward and... Yeah, um, it was seamless. Yeah, it was a seamless move. So in other words, you guys that work your tushy off, I can totally help you. Mm -hmm. And my team and I are here to help and to welcome you and to try yes. to make it as easy as possible. Yeah, and still have fun while you work. That, and that's, a, that's important to me, by the yes. way, because I, I work so hard. I work 24 seven and so does Sherry. Mm -hmm. And we wanna make sure that where we uh, go to work that it's a fun environment, right. you know, it's a, it's, you know, I'm a mom. Yeah. You know, Sherry's a mom too. Right. You know, we, I, I always say that I have a good mom gene. Like I take care of people and I want to make sure that, yeah, I do want to help. I'm a fixer and I'm a helper. Mm -hmm. And I want to make sure that um, the people that come to EXP are taken care of. Sure. We help them. Right. And that we make sure that their transition is smooth, their business is smooth, and it's made easy peasy. I agree, 100%. Right? So you can reach out to Sherry. Yeah, 321-272-7400. Yeah, or you can reach out to me. You guys know my number. It's 772-538-9700. You can ask either one of us about coming to EXP, um, your aspirations of maybe opening up your own office or anything mm -hmm. like that that you have in mind with EXP. Absolutely. Just call if you need any help. Always here to help. We're here to help you guys. Thanks so much. Have a great day, guys.